Rotating Biological Contactors or RBC is a biological treatment unit with attached growth process. In RBC, there is a tank which is filled up with wastewater and a shaft is fitted over the tank which holds number of closely spaced thin circular disc and this shaft rotates at the rate of 1 to 2 rpm. Now let's see how RBC works and carries out the biological treatment of wastewater. The submergence of disc is kept at about 40% and the shaft is continuously rotating in the unit. Now since the shaft is rotating obviously the disc will be continuously rotating and a cycle of submergence in wastewater and exposure to atmosphere that is exposure to air continuously takes place. Now let's consider point number 1 and point number 2 on the disc of RBC unit. Now what will happen at point number 1? Substrate or organic matter will be sticking or adhering to the disc surface. Now in second cycle what will happen? Point number 1 will be here, point number 2 will be here. Now in first cycle, let's say this is first cycle and this is second cycle. In first cycle point number 1 was inside wastewater, it adhered with, it got adhered with, it got stuck up with organic content over the disc surface. Now bacteria needs two things for its survival, food and oxygen. We are specifically talking about aerobic bacteria over here. Okay. Now what is going to happen? The bacteria will be obtaining food when the disc will be inside the wastewater. Okay? With each rotation, the disc will be carrying up some amount of organic matter or specifically saying substrate on its surface. And at point number 2, it will be exposed to air or it will be available with oxygen content. Therefore, when point number 1 is exposed to air, it will be receiving, the bacteria will be receiving oxygen for their decomposition processes. And then in next cycle, the same surface area will be submerging itself in the wastewater. Therefore, a continuous cycle of submergence in wastewater where organic matter attaches itself to the disc and in the next step, it will be exposed to air. Therefore, the two parameters, the two essential parameters that is food as well as oxygen will be continuously made available for the bacteria. Okay, the bacterial film grows over the disc and forms a slimy thin layer which subsequently becomes thicker and once the disc is unable to carry that thick film of bacteria or biological film or biofilm then the thick film slubs off okay it detaches itself from the disc and it goes into the wastewater and again a thin biofilm forms which then grows into a thick biofilm and sloughing off process then subsequently takes place okay this is how a rbc and a rbc rotating biological contactor help in biological treatment of wastewater okay rbc is very much effective in biological treatment and possesses low operating food to microorganism ratio and thus it gives high quality effluent okay so that was all regarding rotating biological contactor i hope you like the video if you like the video please press thumbs up do subscribe to simplified learning for more such videos of civil engineering also follow us on instagram as well as telegram till then take care bye bye